Hello everyone and welcome to Quality Odd Games. Today we are having part 12 of the Siege of Dragonspear campaign in Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition. And it's looking like that we don't have that much to go anymore until we finish this campaign. I would uh, venture to guess about five episodes. So we need to explore this area and then we should get to that uh, Dragon Spear Keep itself. Okay, there is a Null and a Cobalt who are on quest. Okay. So I guess there is the cobalt and here is the null. Nice. Oh. Some hill giants. Actually, they should hit quite hard. But then again, it seems they don't take hits too well. A decent enough battle. Oh. And let's take those face spiders first and then the gargantuan spider excellent so maybe some spider silk somewhere around here a bridge oh Let's see if we can scare most of them away. Oh, some poison neutralization needed. Come on, some hobgoblins cannot be this difficult. Then again, they have decent enough arrows here. So I think it's time for us to rest. Dispel. Okay, nice. And nice as well. Uh, maybe we should actually check this area here before moving northwards. 
And perhaps Savanna could put some of those arrows into good use and others into the ammo belt. Okay. Some beetles. Oh, and apparently we cannot go down from here. Well, I think that's too bad for the box here. But for us, it was rather okay, since we have missile weapons. Almost all of the vents we discover from the area here as a loot seems to have a very small amount of charges left. So I guess we have no other options than to head into this direction. Let's see if there is something useful. Those face uh, spiders are somewhat nasty because they can teleport to the uh, weakest party members and then cause some poisoning and since they don't have too many hit points that can actually be fatal too easily. Well perhaps our party is starting to be on decent enough level so that one face spider cannot cause too much havoc even if it manages to surprise us, but especially in the original uh, Baldur's Gate 1, for example, in the catacombs of Candlekeep, those uh, face spiders can be quite tricky. And what's this? The Forest Queen's Benediction. And apparently only one charge and we cannot even use it. But I think that would have been quite nice an item to have. Nuber. Good for you. Okay, I guess that's some kind of wannabe Nuber we found in the Perecost. And some more of these beetles. Okay. Some hill giants and uh, die wolf. And there is hill giant leader. Hmm. Okay, fortunately he decided to come first alone. Okay, I guess that's going to be the first target. Okay. And unfortunately, not too much to loot. Boring beetles. Hmm.
Okay. And actually, it cannot be that these beetles cause us to load. Apparently it is. Beer skin. Did we have a quest? I guess we did. And some new giants. for those. Okay, apparently he wasn't in the mood to fight. Mm. Maybe a fireball could at least somewhat useful. Apparently, these fights are not that easy. So, maybe we will begin with a couple of fireballs. It's time to take down those weakened enemies. And I think we want to take down that priest rather soon as well. And only 175 experience points from an elite. That's quite little, in my opinion. The protector of the unworthy. Okay, I don't think we want to keep that, but maybe it will fetch us some money at least. Okay, and we can move southwards from here. Let's see if there are some other beetles still. Not too many. I guess that's some kind of cave or shack. Let's see. Soon enough, after we have explored the old area. Hidden cellar. Okay, or cellar. Let's see what's in there. Okay. Shadows, Unsleeping Guardian. I don't like those. Let's take it 
down first. I think it's a one that uh, uses level drain. And we have a greater shadow as well. I don't like those neither. Okay, good. Another greater shadow. I guess we should heal a bit. Okay. That was surprisingly easy fight. And let's hope we can rest successfully. Okay, and there was a trap. And let's see what's in. At least some decent spells. Hmm. And spider silk. Nice. Hmm. Okay. And maybe actually I should give some spells to Duna here. So with this there will be I guess permanent vocalize. Yeah. And I think it's better than the spell we have at the moment and of course if we have some room to spare actually it seems we don't have okay <clears throat> and I think I want to throw that amulet away but we will do with what we have and then it's time to check this northern part of this map and I think we can move westwards and in this kind of situations the boots of speed are especially nice because it makes the exploration quite a bit more fast paced okay shambling mounts and hamadryad Let's see if we can disrupt that spell. Okay, nice. Then we need to take care of the, uh, that mount or those mounts. I guess there were two of them. Was that Minsk or one of those mounts? Another necklace. Armor class plus two. Unfortunately, only usable by Shaman. Okay, some wild boars. Okay, it was Minsk who was shouting. On the other hand, it's nice to have these weaker enemies here. On the other hand, um, it would be nicer to have some challenge in the battles. And since we haven't saved, I think we will try to play this safe and sound. Okay. Hasted Ogres Does not look too promising I think we need to be careful not to get killed here Uh, 
and who is in panic? And unfortunately, Okay, so that is an ogre mage. And actually this fight is taking quite a lot of the healing potions we have. And finally, that was rather a tough fight. And we have not too much to show for it. I think it's best to rest. Some beers. They shouldn't be too difficult to deal with. Let's give the rest another try. Hmm. Okay, so achievement harpers gift unlocked. Cave. Okay, let's visit it. There. Okay, apparently we cannot get in there right away. Oh! And it seems we have the whole party with us. So that gargantuan spider didn't manage to put any of us in a web. And I think we can enter the cave now. And there is not too much to explore in this area. Hmm. Those bodies look a bit worrisome and it seems now we need to save Antolonia and I guess those face spiders are a bit more problematic and of course we need to make sure that those sword spiders don't manage to skewer Antolonia Mm, 
maybe a couple of more healing spells wouldn't hurt. In the original Baldur's Gate, that was not the, uh, the enhanced edition. Come on. You had to manually do all the healing. So that was quite annoying. Hmm. Actually, this area here looks like rather dangerous, so let's check for traps. And of course we cannot save. Oh! So we have some strong enemies around here, at least this one we want to take care of. Okay, good. Then let's take this killer mimic. And then these jellies. <coughs> and hopefully quick enough so that Dunahaya will survive. <coughs> so let's give the chest another look. Okay. Longbow. Hmm. Looks rather nice. I think we could give it to Minsk. And I guess that needs to be put away. So I don't think we need that one anymore. But that bow should be come handy. And then we have some arrows. And I guess those will become handy as well. And let's rest and finish. Okay, nice. So, the gift hit points, charisma, immunity to fatigue. I guess we will use that. Of course, we might want to summon those Ankiks at some point. So let's not throw that item away. So, still some um, amount of the area to explore. Horst and Stalia. Okay. Mm. And they are actually paying quite well. Glad to meet you, friend. Oh, we don't want to sell that. From here... This one... Hmm. 
guess okay that belt wasn't worth too much and let's see if we have something else to sell I think we want to sell that ring of Visadi, even though we have two of them. So maybe we actually could sell it. And from here, I guess we can sell that one. Perhaps Stone Pike as well. Here. At least this one. Okay, nice. And there is not much to buy, but at least they paid a good price. That at the very least is something. So we are doing a good progress towards our 100,000 we lost at the beginning of the game. I'm just wondering, was there some difficulties in uh, kind of scripting so that you would retain the money for what was the point of taking it away? Or would it have been too easy once you could have purchased everything you need at the start of this expansion? Then again, in most cases you would have had at least some very decent items. I think we will take care of that wolf before it will attack us. Some wild boars once again. So, not much else to explore, Orok Elite. I guess that's our primary target here. And then let's take care of the rest of those guys. Okay. Orok Marauder. A new primary target. What? Only 150 experience points. That's actually laughable. Hurry up. Very well. And the loot is rather indecent as well. Okay, I think... We will just finish our exploration of the area and head back to the camp. And let's see what's the situation in there. Okay, we could enter the Dragon Spear Castle. Let's see. Let's head here first. Maybe we could rest here. Nice. we cannot get in from the front door but let's make some snooping around okay looks like a wizard or priest 
Or maybe they are just ordinary mercenaries. child rescued seems the castle is pretty much in ruin or rather in large part in ruin okay and of course the real question here is can we do something in this area that will be beneficial in the future at least that uh, gatekeeper or whatever she was wasn't hostile but apparently we cannot get in. So let's head back to the camp. The crusade attacks. The northern edge of the camp's aflame. Head south to the fire pit. The commanders gather there. I know we've had our disagreements, but luck to you. Find Andrus fast as you can. And take care. Okay. Okay. So who were we supposed to talk to? When Fossey refined those explosives into the barrel of Bush, she was left with highly unstable toxic residue. We were thinking of using it as you have to hold the crusade off while I stabilize the barrels as best I can. Hmm. Okay. I'll let you know. You can choose which unit to fight with against them. When the enemy is defeated, or if you're forced to retreat, talk to me again. And fortunately, for once, we are getting these rather cheaply. So, <clears throat> I'm going to stay here and ward these explosive barrels. If the crusade reaches them, we're finished. Take a squad of soldiers and deal with those trolls. Hmm. I think we will take archers here. When you've dealt with the immediate threat, or if you can't defeat the trolls, return to me. Good luck to you, so where are those trolls here?
and I think a fireball would do well. And let's see if we can at least panic some of them. And it seems we are doing rather nice. Okay. And without suffering any casualties, Safana's fingers are itching already. Or maybe it was my fingers. And do they have anything useful here? Some armor. And I think we want to have that equivalent of rest before going to the next battle. Okay, that wasn't too good. So where was this? Was it Dosia? Yeah. Okay, and I think we want to heal. Oh. Okay, I guess we need to use healing before resting. So, first attack repelled. Another messenger, it seems. Wizards. Damn it all. I can't leave these barrels without putting the entire camp. I guess um take a squad and keep them away from here. We'll use wizard slayers. We should have rather decent answer to any wizard. Yes. Uh, maybe not that spell. Okay. That should do rather well because it should prevent those from casting any spells. So we should have rather easy time taking them down. Okay, apparently not that easy anymore. Nice and easy. And even some loot available. Let's take the best picks. Archmage, I think that would be rather decent for Duna here. And a Wand of Frost with rather small amount of charges. But let's take what we get. <clears throat>
Okay. So. Let's see if we can get some healing now. And let's see if we can get a bit rest. Okay. So, I guess three more waves at least to come, since we have three unit groups left. Unfortunately, it seems we don't have an ability to reuse any of our troop contingents, because even though it seems all of them survived. Let's take War Mages. And I think we should be able to buy a little time. So did we get only one unit. Okay, so these units are coming back and I think it's time for us to strike. Hmm. Okay, it seems we are doing reasonably well. So let's see if there is anything useful to loot. Doesn't seem to be the case. Okay, I guess we are done, except Shahira could get a level. Level 6 spell, that's nice. I guess we can take that one. Let's take that one. And here... Heal, of course, is nice, but I think conjuring fire elemental is even nicer. So let's get some healing. Let's get Chaira back to shape. And I think we could rejuvenate a bit. Oh. Well, that wasn't good. Hmm. Be. We should use the moment to finish the Crusaders. The center lane is clear. Head straight north and finish off their remaining warriors. Okay. I guess we will then just go. Okay, 
I think we can withdraw a bit. And... Maybe we should try to detect invisible... Or invisible. And then Lanak just made, I guess, herself the primary target here. And then Orlef Blackfinger. He will be next. And then we still have Grimgore here. I guess he utilized some sort of... Was it Sanctuary or whatever it was? Another one. And it was a spy who finished him. Not nice. But I think the loot here should be rather nice. One. Oh, what was this? Flail plus two. I guess it will be sold. And then these final two should be easily identified. And about the vents, unfortunately, I think the number of charges is rather low. Sword, did we get? Short sword. Well, I have to say that. Hmm. Actually, rather nice short sword. Especially against Meichai. But do we have anything still in this area that we could use? Nothing here. So let's head to the Dragon Spear Castle. Well, 
I agree that was rather morale arousing speech. Okay. So that's actually I think that were the retreating crusaders. Well, that doesn't look too efficient. Maybe I should have uh, uh, pushed further through the cellar of the castle while I had the chance. And I think we will continue from here next time. So thank you very much for watching. If you like the content, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And feel free also to post comments, ask questions and so on. Have a great rest of the day. Quality Old Games out.